Hey the puppy dogs! It's Real Puppy here, once again with another top 5 video. Well, actually this is probably my first top 5 video, considering I have done either a top 10 or top 5 in a very long time. So, since Earth Day is drawing near, I decided to do a top 5 grass type Pokemon. Now these are my favorite type of grass type Pokemon, but if you would like to, please leave a comment down below and tell me what your favorite grass type Pokemon is or are if you have more than one. So anyway, without further ado, let's get right into this list. It's Ivysaur! Ivysaur! Most of you are probably wondering why I put Ivysaur on this list instead of Bulbasaur or Venusaur. Now don't get me wrong, I love Bulbasaur and Venusaur. Bulbasaur mostly because it's cute and it's adorable with a little bulb on its back, and Venusaur because of how cool looking it is and how tropical it looks. In, this, in a way, but Ivysaur, I have to say, is a combination of those two, cute and cool. I mean, just look at it. It is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Chikorita is another one, of course, with the Bulbasaur family and the Chikorita family both being dinosaur plant Pokemon. I decided to put Chikorita on this list mostly because of how cute and little it is. I mean, look at it. It has a leaf on top of its head. It's adorable. Just look at that face. Hanging from a big tree? That's Leafeon's room. Of course, it couldn't go without putting an Eeveelution on this list. Just look at this thing. It has leaves on its paws, on its ears, and a leaf for a tail. Look at it! It is adorable! And seriously, I would love to have this type of Pokemon in my garden as a pet. I mean, just look at it. It is the cutest little thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Just look at it. Rosalia, Butterfree, let's go! Rosalia! Now before Badoo and Rose Raid, there was Rosilia. I actually thought it was a pretty cool Pokemon, mostly because it had flowers for hands. I mean, just look at it. Two of them are different colors, and I haven't checked out its shiny form yet, but I honestly would love to have this Pokemon working in my garden with the flowers and everything. Just, it's so graceful looking. Look at it. The number one pick had to go to Servine. I mean, I know I have like a fear of snakes and everything, and this Pokemon looks more reptilian before it goes into its superior thing. But I put Servine on this list most because of how cool it looks and how beautiful it looks and because of how cute it looks. I remember getting either Pokemon Black or White 2 before and choosing Snivy as my starter because of how cute it looked and as soon as it evolved into Servine I'm just like, oh my god! I was seriously in a major fangirl shock in my opinion. But anyway, that's all I have for this video. I apologize if it was short but I had to do it a little bit quickly today because I have a lot to do. But anywho, I hope y'all like this video, and happy Earth Day everybody if you celebrate Earth Day. And if you do celebrate Earth Day, please do something nice for the Earth and take real good care of this because this is the only planet we have to live on to survive. And without it, we will be dead. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content, and I'll see y'all later. Stay awesome, stay strong, and stay beautiful, my little puppies. Bye-bye!